the uh, European Union Eastern Partnership Culture and Creativity Program uh, is supporting the cultural operators from six uh, uh, partnership countries uh, Georgia, Armenia, Azerbaijan, Ukraine, Belarus and Moldova to reform the culture policies, to strengthen the cultural management and leadership, uh, leadership skills. It is very important that the cultural operators from Eastern Partnership countries get these personal contacts uh, from European Union. This is exactly the reason why we brought uh, these cultural operators to Slovenia to build bridges, to learn from the Slovenian experience on how to write good projects. It was really great. It was productive, at least for me. Um, I did have pretty good contact. I didn't expect it. Uh, such, such a really diverse and uh, various um, aspects of the cultural and the creative industries. It was really loaded with all sorts of uh, interesting places, people, connections, interaction. I think the key for me was that I, I tried to come here with an open mind, so it was empty, absolutely. And that empty mind has been absolutely filled up to the brims and blown away. Slovenia has become so successful uh, in European Union in writing successful applications for Creative Europe. So it was natural choice to bring countries that have just joined the Creative Europe to learn from the best. I think Slovenia knows better and understands better from where countries like Ukraine and Moldova and Georgia and others come from. What are the challenges that these countries face? And most importantly, we have simply amazing partners here with Motovila, with Creative uh, Europe Desk uh, Slovenia, but also the great interest from Slovenian counterparts. More than 50, 60 uh, different organizations, uh, cultural operators showed up. And it is very important for us that it's not one-way street. It's not that the, the, the cultural operators from the East come here to learn from you, but also that you would learn something from there. And we saw that kind of a magic happening. I didn't know that there are so many hidden, wonderful cultural people and cultural things happening in Slovenia. It's not only international, but also locally strong um, uh, communication. We had numerous meetings, having new partners after these meetings, but mainly we know Slovenia in depth. It's always difficult to expect quick results uh, immediately, today, today, tomorrow. It takes time, especially when we talk about Creative Europe projects. But actually, uh, when I saw the intensity of uh, discussions between the operators from different countries, uh, I'm absolutely sure that it was already a big success. And by the end of the day, before the participants left from Slovenia, the first collaboration contract was already signed between the Slovenian and Georgian participants. So it can't be any more practical uh, than that.